Welcome to On the Spectrum. I'm your host, Terry Matthews, and this is the show where we inform you, entertain you, and encourage you about all things autism. We like to call it Prescription TV. So every Thursday, I do a product review. This has to be one of my very favorites, um, and this is called Bedtime Bunny. We're gonna tell you about what's hot about this product and what's not. All you need to do is figure out if you should buy it. So Bedtime Bunny is awesome for a whole bunch of reasons. This is a, a, a game that you can pick up at a local retailer. It's typically less than $20, and I'm sure if you can't get out, you can definitely log online, and I'm sure you'll be able to find it and get it shipped if you can do that. Now what's cool about this game is it teaches a child sequence and we know that our kiddos are always interested in sequence. I used to have the biggest issue getting Jaden to bed and it was like how do I get this kid to bed? How do I figure out a routine? And this awesome game unfortunately they came out it with it after he had learned sequencing but it's a pretty cool game and I think every parent should try this at home. So here is what it comes with. It comes with this cool awesome board right? And it tells you basically, first I play with my toy in the bathtub. Next, I use the potty. Then you put on your pajamas all the way from start to crawling into bed, getting some rest. And then it comes with these cool little things. Like there's a dice, um, a bunny rabbit, and there's these different shapes that um, are on here. And you actually put those shapes in each one of these uh, shape holders that are cut out. So I'm just gonna play a little bit for you so that you can see exactly how easy and simple this game is. You could also, a trick that I do is, if your child doesn't normally play in the bathtub, you could just wipe this out and put something else that your child does. So these are easily to interchange, just cover it up, no biggie. So here we have a dice. The bunny rabbit always starts at the very beginning. You're gonna roll this dice, whoops. And let's see what color we get. Blue, you would move to blue. Then you would ask the child, first I play with my toy. What shape goes in here? So this child would take the duck and you could ask them or find the duck, find the boat, whatever side you decide. And once they put it in there, then they would go to the next one. So just another example, roll it green. So automatically it, they go here. Next, I use the potty. And you would find the shape that fits in there and they would put it in there. Now what's interesting about this, they can actually do what this says. Play in the bath, go to the potty, and come back to the game, or you can go through this game. There is no winner, there is no loser. But playing with our kids, what it does is it releases serotonin, which calms them down, makes them optimistic, and it helps them focus, and it's an easy game. So if you have those kiddos that just don't have a lot of attention span, that's okay, because this game won't take forever and you'll be able to crawl them right in bed and get them to sleep so you can get some other things done. So now that I've taken the guesswork out of all the details, the only thing left for you to figure out is should you buy it? For more information about this game or other products, please log on to www.terrymatthewsonline.com. Thank you for joining us. See you next time on The Spectrum.